we've learned some stories about weed ecology as well. One of the weeds that has evolved or at least been released from competition is this Malva neglecta, common mallow. It has basically formed a strong dominant part of the vegetative system along with chickweed and all of the annual weeds that we had when we began. Lamb's quarters, redroot pigweed, quack grass have all disappeared or have been very much marginalized compared to, to these two weeds. And there was a time I was quite concerned about it because it, it's become very dominant, as you can perhaps see here. I just happened to look up in Bob Parn's fertile soil what actually the nutrient value of this particular weed is. And according to Parn's, mallows contribute 80 pounds of nitrogen per ton, which is actually higher than what legume hay will contribute. So what's going on here is obviously this is not a nitrogen fixer as the clovers are, as the leg legumes are, so how come there's so much nitrogen? And basically what has been suggested is that this plant is a very good scavenger, a very good accumulator of nitrogen, and that it helps cycle it through the system. And because I'm creating over the last 11 years here, a system based on recycled nutrients, we've created perfect habitat for this scavenger.